Hello everyone, Sigmalator here. Welcome back to Bioshock 2. Right, I've searched all of you, got that. Don't need you. You're out of order. Okay. need to get used to the sensitivity of this mouse. Can I collect these? That is useful. New diary. Lamb is becoming a problem. The woman is a damned collectivist. Here in Rapture, how could the council fail to see it? Worse, to hide her intent, she gulls these patience of hers into a religious frenzy. A new Kremlin will rise and swallow the council house before they realize they've been had. I will not have my city swindled by the parasite. Whatever its guys. Love it's what you've done with the place. To call Sinclair. Okay, so this lamb woman was trying her hardest to undermine Ryan from the beginning, it looks like. Oh, oh shit, I've got the... Uh... Uh... There we go. Had the special ammo equipped. Right, what was I supposed to be doing? I think I was supposed to be dropping... Uh, the little sister off, aren't I? We'll talk to you in a minute. There are stuff in here. Or up here. You gotta remember, I'm the man of the house, and that means she's gotta be hanged. Uh, I know this game is set in the 50s, but still. That is very, that's a very 50s attitude to have, mate. Rapture is a paradise of the ego, Eleanor. Under Ryan, the voices of an entire city sing the virtues of greed and pride. But truth, rather, is in the body. Already they grow weary of struggling against one another in fruitless competition. Observe the bent back. The drawn faces. Ryan promised us more, they seem to say. In what shall we now believe? And Eleanor, it is our task to answer. Alright then, what have you got to say? The parasite makes nothing for itself. Its only tools are taxes and tithes meant to trick you into offering what it has not earned. In rapture. I see. Yeah, I'm all for for keeping what you have worked for and made yourself. On the surface, the scientist invests the power of his mind in a single miraculous idea <laughs> and naturally begins to rise above his fellows. But the parasites... Yay! No. It was me! Oh no. I'm not sure I agree with that. We should be encouraging people who have made good, who have made significant discoveries, not pushing them back down. Or is he talking about the surface work, the surface dwellers? What's in there? Nothing. An artist strives to frame his ideals in an image. Challenge his audience and make his vision immortal. But the parasites say, No, your art must serve the cause. Your ideals endanger the people. Uh, 
Yeah, so he was talking about those evil service dwellers. I mean, you could you could try to hide instead of just popping right out in front of me. You're doing yourself a hacking disservice there. What have we got here? Oh, a new hacky thing. All right, give me the free shit. Thank you. Let's reload that. Get those heavy rivets, anti personnel rounds, they might be quite useful. Build some of those up, and I think that will do. Definitely hack you, get some, get a free health kit. Oh shit, where am I now? Oh, okay, I'm back here. Getting all kerfuddled. Check all the nooks and crannies. Right, what have you got to say? Lacking its own ingenuity, the parasite fears the visionary. But it cannot plagiarize, it seeks to censor. But it cannot regulate, it seeks to ban. Rapture was founded on an idea, and here they are held inviolate. Can't help but think a lot of what he's saying could be could definitely apply to today's politics. Now, Hello. Turnbaum would have you turn that sister human again. You'll get just enough Adam for our purposes, and the girls are likely to try to repay you somehow. But Rapture's a high-stakes town, son, and she is a jackpot. You just have to be willing to take it all. You'll harvest more Adam than the price of one plasmid, so the rest is gravy. Think about it. Down here, it's your survival or hers. Well, I let them live in the last playthrough, and I'm going to let them live again. At the end of the day, it is not their fault what they have become. And I am just not heartless enough to kill these poor thick girls. I know. How awful of me. I'm not a monster after all. More health. Thank you. Uh, no, can't pick up any more rivets. That oh, yes, thank you. I so much prefer this hacking system than the first one. About to shoot him. What did you give me? No. Okay. Oh, another one of those. That's good to know. 
Bringing letters sister to an event allows you to choose whether to rescue or harvest her. If you harvest, you get maximum Adam to spend, but she will not survive the process. Yes, I remember. Take this. And F to rescue. Off you go, little one. But I will have some Adam from you first. There you go. Well, our tin man had a heart all along. Personally, I call that a liability. But you have enough Adam now. Barely. Head to the Hall of the Future and splice up with Incinerate. Off you go, little one. You are safe. Right, now we can get ourselves incinerate. Not my favourite of the plasmids, but it, it has it definitely has its uses. Sneak up on me like that. Right, could you? Is that enough now? Jesus. Oh, I can't use the Tommy gun, but I can take the ammo out of it. Okay. Right, you got stuff. Thank you. Grab those. All right. Journey to the surface. On okay. the surface, your parents sought a private life. Using their great talents to provide for you. They learn to twist the lies of church and government, believing themselves masters of the system. But the parasite said, No, the child has a duty. He will go to war and die for the nation. What a delightful take on the uh, situation. Hey, Pucci. Yeah, you guard that wall. Okay. How oh, do I need to find the giant hand? Yes. Okay. What have we got here? Two weeks at my last count. Two weeks since we were trapped in this rotten park. been eating. The children need all the supplies we've got left. Need them more than I do. I, I don't know what's going to happen. I can feel myself getting weaker. The children have noticed the condition I'm in, of course. What will happen once I'm gone? I'll be all alone. Uh. Didn't really listen to most of that because I got distracted. Never mind. I'm sure it was useful information. Ooh, time to upgrade. Yes. Increase the clip size. Much better. Sinclair today of Sinclair Solutions. It's this pseudo-legal firm he set up to take problems Ryan doesn't want to admit he has and make them go away. I could fill 40 front pages of the Tribune with stories about this fella if he wasn't paying me not to. And he's got work for me, right? I ask what? And he flashes me these thousand dollar Steinman teeth saying this job will, quote, 
change history. Will it now? Let's fix your face, baby. No, my face is fine, thanks. So, well, it's the only one I've got, so I'll deal with it. Hack. No! Hack. What have you got for me? Hello, Dave. Oh, yeah, I can search them for bullets. Thank you. That would be most useful. Well, that was a long ass way to get around here. Wait, what? I think the arrow got confused there for a second. Fun with that, you lot. <laughs> Good job, little Bertram. Right. Collect all of the things. What, what are you going to say? Unable to provide for itself, the need of the parasite grows until war is made to justify it. Your parents brought you to Rapture where you need never fear the parasites again. So you see, there is no place for you on the surface. But you may bring the world to you. If you know someone who belongs in Rapture, write a letter to the Ryan Industries mail room. And you never know. The next new face might be familiar. Wow, somebody really didn't like Ryan. Guessing it's all these splicers who follow Lamb. Oh good, it's that song again. I'm so thrilled to be hearing it again. We've got there. I know this facility is vital for the preservation of secrecy and rapture. But seeing myself transformed into that lurching, waxen nightmare. Do children truly respond to this? Still, I spoke to a young man exiting the park after the grand opening, asking him what, if anything, he had learned. He said his chores didn't seem so bad anymore, as long as Mother wouldn't send him to the surface. Interesting. So what was the problem? be gone. I don't know how I missed this lot before. Where am I going? Right, you're already hacked. You're fine. Bastard pile of junk! 
You broke it, didn't you, Edna? Everything you touch turns to shit! Me? You're mean, Roger. The war in heaven far beyond starts your meaning. Yes, I know I've hacked it. Good job. I'm going to call you Gerald. Bert's the one that flies. Gerald is the one that stays. Good job, Gerald. Yee. That is very useful. Thank you, Clownface. Right, take all your stuff. There was an. Where's the other one? You would drain the people of their life's blood. Rapture is a body, Delta. I am the voice, and Big Sister is the hand. When Rapture speaks of you, it says only this. Sleep now. Your day is done. Whatever, crazy lady. Yeah, and I'm just not feeling the name Delta. Oh, I'm just not feeling the feeling the name Delta. Why not something a bit more with a bit more pizzazz, like Omega? See, that's a good strong name. We lost another of the Alpha Series protectors today in testing. Somewhere outside the city limits, he simply vanished. For these men, Rapture has no walls. We must find a method of conditioning them against abandonment of the little sisters. Something physical, possibly even lethal. The lab aides are starting to call them big daddies. Perhaps there's some genius to that. Bonded pairs, connected by a love that kills. Oh, I see. I'm called Delta because I'm one of the uh, later models, I gather. Alright, incinerate. Yes, I know how that works. Health upgrade and upgrade Eve. Yes. There. Congratulations on your recent purchase of the incinerate plasmid. Thank you. Say, Tom here is having a romantic evening with a gal. What would impress her more than lighting the fireplace with a snap of your fingers? <laughs> oh yeah, that went very well. Hope you're enjoying your date, you two. <laughs> okay. Oh, but this party just hit the skids. Carl needs a light for his cigar, and no one can help him. That one looks broken. Uh, I might have missed one. Alright, I don't know what's happening, so I'm just going to leave. Ah, I'm guessing you have to go this way because of all the ice. Do you have available? Okay, I've got no Adam, but some useful things in there. Oh no! I'm thinking there's going to be. A boss fight of some variety. I've, have I only got one Eve? Oh, 
crap. Oh no, how I can buy more. There we go. Uh, got. Whoa! Hello. Oh, you've got telekinesis, you cheating git. Run out of health. God damn it. You've been revived. Okay. Holy Moses, son. Not even a big sister can keep you down. Well, come on back and melt the ice and we can say goodbye to this two bit carny ride. What, did I kill her? Hang on. I would very much like to uh, retrieve stuff from her body if she's dead. Oh, good. I'll have the Adam too. Right, what, what are the big sisters? A big sister combines the strength of a big daddy with the atom draining abilities of a little sister. They are armoured, deadly and can survive out in the ocean, but are also able to drain Adam from corpses to power plasmid abilities. When a little sister is abducted by a splicer, the big sisters are the last line of defence. Emerging from the shadows to hunt down the attacker, the little sister is then returned to the system to start her work anew. Or the Adam itself is recovered from the offending splicer. Along with dashing and slashing attacks, big sisters may wield genetic abilities like incinerate and telekinesis. Yes, we've seen both of those now. Big sisters are incredibly agile and can jump up to perch on walls like a spider splicer, catching their targets unaware. Well, that's a massive pain in the ass. But they're not invincible, thankfully. Must have been the leftover fire that killed her off. Alright. I don't really use the drill. Maybe I should use that for up close attacks. Let's get some health kits, and some more of those. I'm not going to use. Hello? I'm not going to use a health kit now because so I can find uh, a healing station. That would be the smarter thing to do. Is there a healing station in here? Hey, we have thawed the frozen ice. Ah, standard spot. You're proven to be quite a windfall. Now just open the train tunnel from the security booth there, and I'll come out and jump on. Cool. Hi there, fella. You're gonna be... I like to look a man in the eye when I give him my word. You and me, kid. We're going places. Hey, right, you're just gonna leave me here. I had thought you some golem of Sinclair's, brought here to hold Rapture's arms while he rifles through her pockets. But no, you are aware of your plight. Who, I wonder, would be so cruel to force a mirror on a man with no face? Lem was waiting for us. Come out shooting and start the train. 
All right. Now I'm allowed out. Okay, I accidentally changed. Die, all of you. Stop shooting. Where did the other bodies go? Oh, never mind. Let's just get out of here. Warning, you're about to leave this level. Make sure you've done everything you want to here before proceeding beyond this point. What does that mean? Oh, never mind. We'll have to find out in the next episode. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been Sigma Later. This has been Bioshock 2, and I'll catch you next time. Take care now.